Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, Rays of Sunshine. Today I'm going to be doing something different. I'm not going to do a tutorial. I'm actually doing a vlog because I have a fashion shoot, a photo shoot today. <laughs> so you guys are going to accompany me while I do this photo shoot for Scarlet Magazine. And here we go. Also, my nose is not typically this red. It's just that it's cold in Ohio and I'm kind of sick, so I'm sad about that. But my face looks kind of moist, dewy wet whatever adjective you'd like to use but it looks like this because I um, used my vitamin C glow moisturizer from the body shop and I put on a little bit of eye cream from Acure uh, I like to do that to prime my face prep my face actually I like to do that to prep my face um, before photo shoots because my makeup is being done for me today so we'll see how this goes here's my pre photo shoot snack um, there's just some chamomile tea with lemon and um, honey and this is pineapples, granola, uh, craisins, and mangoes. This jewelry was provided by Red Giraffe Designs. They have a boutique here in the short north, which is what we were doing the photo shoot for. But they also have an Etsy shop, so I'll link that below. So I'm still waiting on makeup, but I just did my eyebrows. Um, this is the first outfit for today. I'm wearing the black wrap necklace, which I'm going to insert a picture of here. And it goes really well with the rings um, that they provided as well. And just another view of the rings. This is from Charlotte Russe, and these jeans are from Forever 21. No, these jeans are definitely from American Eagle. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> but these are actually my favorite. Um, they're like jeggings, and I wear these pretty often. High-waisted jeggings from American Eagle. So as always, I'm busy and I'm on a time crunch. So I'm going to start my foundation while the makeup artist is doing the other girls. So just dampening my beauty blender with water, of course. Using that out, making it sh sure it's not too wet but moist enough. And then um, getting all the excess water off with a paper towel, just using that. These are the products I'm going to use for my base today. Uh, this is a little bit darker and this is a little bit lighter, so I'm going to mix these two. And this is the concealer that I love and I'm going to use with this. So the bottom one is the Maybelline foundation and the top one's the Naked foundation. I'm just going to mix these two together. So now I put some on my face with my finger and I put the excess on the bottom of this beauty blender. And I'm just going to beauty blend, do all of that. And I'll check back when I'm done. So I put my Kat Von D concealer on my face and now I'm just going to blend it out with that same damp beauty blender. Uh, usually I have more of a contrast between my concealer and foundation, but today it's kind of like a natural look. Um, you know, it's a photo shoot, so they wanted something kind of natural for this magazine. Um, so yeah, not too much of a contrast, but just highlighted enough. Now I'm not exactly going to bake with this, but I am going to set my face with this, specifically the concealed area. Now to do this, I'm using um, this same damp beauty blender, and I'm also going to use a little bit of this right here. And because I'm not going to dust this off, um, I'm just going to... Blend out the edges, kind of just tap on top of it as well just to make sure it's in my skin. And it's setting everything because I'm probably going to wear this makeup or a pumped up version of it um, for a dinner I'm going to tonight. Okay, so I added some highlight. Um, I mixed two. I will put them in the description box, but I also added some bronzer in Leo by Kylie Jenner lip gloss. No, Leo by Kylie Jenner lip liner and then Toasted Marshmallow lip gloss. Now I'm just looking for where we're actually shooting outside. So this is the photographer shooting with one of the other models and here's some behind the scenes of my part of the photo shoot. So 
that's a wrap for the photo shoot. Um, some of the other models did two outfits um, with like other jewelry, but I actually have a meeting to go to for my fashion organization, Heart of It All Fashion. Um, so I had to only do one, unfortunately, but it was really fun working with Scarlet Magazine again. That's my second time shooting with them in like, uh, probably like two months, a month and a half. So that was so much fun. Um, overall experience was pretty good. <clears throat> Hair and makeup was supposed to be provided, but as usual, as a black model, I tend to do end up doing my own hair and makeup. Um, that's just how it is in the business, especially in Columbus. But, yeah, it was pretty fun. I enjoyed it. Here's a sneak peek of the last frame from the photo shoot. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you next week.